Appalachian League Baseball tonight. The Flyboys taking on the state liners. Only this time, the home team was reversed. 0-0, 0-0 until the top of the fourth. Brady Francisco left his heart there. Hits it into the fielder's choice. Liners get B.J. Parrott out at second, but the boys, Brody Johnson, will come home. It was 1-0. Still top of the fourth. Tennessee Volunteer, Ariel Antigua. Antigua will send the ball to left field. Nick Arias will come home, and the Flyboys extended their lead 2-0. The boys will keep things rolling. Paul Taylor will find the opening in left field. That would score two runs. Flyboys will keep things rolling. They win tonight 9-4. Nearing the end of the game between the Colcats and the Doughboys, and the fans pumped up. Bottom of the A, Tri-Cities native and Tennessee Vol, Kobe Backus, drives this pitch to left field. Gunner Borey will come home from second. Doughboys out front 9-7. Top of the ninth. Cats are in catch-up mode. Cooper McKenzie singles on a ground ball to center. That allows him to reach first. But it wasn't enough because the very next batter, pitcher Griffin Howe, sends down the batter swinging to secure the Doughboys victory and finish the game 9-7. In Elizabethan tonight, the River Riders were hosting the River Turtles of Pulaski. Despite a 30-minute rain delay, the Riders stayed hot. Tennessee Vol Marcus Phillips strikes out Kevin Jones looking for the first out of the night. Bottom of the first, Elizabethan would strike Jane Loblander. Hits a home run, his fifth of the year, over the fence in left field for a two-run shot. It was 2-0 River Riders. Rob Liner. Turtles get out of the inning. Matt Porter strikes out Kate Huff, swinging for strike three. Pulaski comes back to win 6-3. Appalachian League tonight, one score to report. On the road, Burlington beats Kingsport 12-5.